what is going on everybody? It is Gary the Bear and I'm back to you guys again with a brand new video. In today's video, I'm going to be trying 10 different types of trolley gummies. Now, I'm not entirely sure how different all these flavors are going to be, but we've got watermelon shark, llamas, very berry worms, the traditional sour bright crawlers, we've got the sour gummy creations, these are like gummy, just like random pieces you can put together. I'm excited for this, this is gonna be cool. Then we've got the big bold bears, they're not sour, as far as I can tell, but they're big and they're bold. Then we've got the fruit punch crawlers, sour bright octopus, sour bright blast, these are like gushers, but sour and bright and crawly. And then finally we have the sour bright mystery night crawlers. I'm really excited to get into this guys and if you are excited as well be sure and leave a like let me know down in the comments And also if you're brand new to the channel consider subscribing it is free and you can always unsubscribe if you feel the need to do so later so I think first off well, let me, let me tell you first how we're gonna do this. I'll probably just rank these one to ten It might be hard though because they're all probably gonna be very similar in taste, but hey, we'll try it anyway First up you've got the crawlers the traditional Oh boy, these bags are all gonna open up so horribly look at this. It's not gonna be good guys We're gonna do the traditional sour bright crawlers I'm so excited for this, but these are good. They're classics. I had the red and the blue personally the red and the blue are my favorite I don't know should I try multiple different flavors. We have cherry lemon strawberry grape. Oh strawberry grape is what that is I did not know that was strawberry grape. I thought it was like red blue. So for right now those are in first place Awesome next up we have the fruit punch Ugh. A fruit punch two fruit punch flavors. They're, they're new apparently flavors here are I don't know is it I think it's just two different flavors red and orange mm, Yo at least the red and orange of the fruit punch are fire. Yo, they're not nearly as sour. They're more of a sweet, fruity, kind of tangy flavor. I dig these though. I really like these. I've never had the fruit punch ones until now, but like, I'm pleasantly surprised. So far, I'm gonna put them right there with the originals for now. Next up, let's go to the big bold bears. I gotta get something that's not quite as sour just to kind of sort of even out the palate. Whoa, that's a, here, smell that. Oh, yeah. Yo, these are like intense. Okay, so this is, I believe, a lemon lime bear. These are all right. The flavor is not very prominent, and the texture, they're a little bit chewy like they're a little hard to get through wild cherry they're good they're okay they're not up there though they're third place thus far all right i think next we're gonna go let's do the mystery night crawlers mystery night crawlers next i'm excited to see how the mystery flavor is represented in here it's like a very cream white can you guess okay are there supposed to be oh best by september 7th <laughs> They don't expire, they're just best before that date. That's an interesting flavor combination. I don't know what this tastes like, but they're all right. It, it's, it's, it's annoying whenever they have the, like, the random flavors, the mystery flavors, and they don't have like, they don't have it listed the options of what they could be. It's always just like, yeah, you have to guess out of the billions of flavors in the entire world that they are. Like it could be like roast beef flavored and you have no idea. Overall, I'd say they're a little better than the bears, but they're not fruit punch or original. We're gonna go to one of the first, like, well, one of the second animal shape. We got sour bright llamas. I'm excited to try these. They're interesting, they look interesting. And you know, I was actually I was actually incorrect whenever I said earlier that I was expecting all these to taste the same because really none of them have tasted you know the same. They've tasted similar but not the same. Alright, this is a really, really miscombobulated looking llama. Look at this guy. Really weird. It looks more like a dinosaur. Sour bright llamas. Not bad. Ooh. In the llamas, the red and blue is a strawberry blueberry, not a strawberry grape. I like that better. Now there is one I want to try. It's mango and passion fruit. The orange and purple. No, no, excuse me. There's mango berry punch. The green yellow is passion fruit pineapple. The green yellow one was the first one I tried, and that was really good. That has thoroughly... Wow, that's gonna good. I'm a fan. I almost, I wanna put these above the traditional, but I wanna try the fruit punch again because I might like these better than the fruit punch as well. I think the, the more unique flavor profiles they have, they have the passion fruit, they have the mango, the pineapple. There's so many different unique flavors. The llamas, I think are gonna take first place for me. All right, we've got listen, five flavors to go. I wanna go in and try the watermelon shark. There's only one flavor, but the shape. We have to see about the shape. See if the sharks taste good. I've never actually had like shark. I've never eaten shark. Let me know down in the comments if you've ever eaten a shark before. I think it's a thing. I think it's one of those things you can't eat certain places of the world. Here's the watermelon shark. Look at that. Not bad. I think it looks pretty good. These have a different consistency than all the other ones I've had so far. Like, as you saw, I just bit it right in half. It gets stuck in my teeth really, really bad. I don't know. I think the flavor's nice, but the texture's a little weird. I feel like if it was more gummy, like actually more gummy instead of less being able to bite it in half. If there was more gummy aspect to it, like if it had the texture of the llamas or even the bears, honestly, I feel like it would be better. I will probably put it just a hair above the bears just because, again, the flavor's there and it's a lot better. And actually, I think I like it better, like the flavor-wise. I like it better than the Nightcrawlers as well, or the mystery ones. But again, it wasn't a lot. I'm trying to debate on which one I should save for last, but for right now, I'm gonna do the very, the very berry, which we got raspberry blueberry, strawberry blackberry, 
and blue raspberry berry punch. These are gonna be good, I think. And legit, guys, I tell I kid you not, the only of all of these, the only ones I've actually had are the original, regular, traditional Sour Bright Crawler. So I'm really excited to try some of these. So this one, got a blue raspberry and berry punch. Man, this is a tough competition. I can't even lie. These are good. And this is strawberry blackberry. That's very good. Then we've got raspberry blueberry. I like that all the red blues are different flavors. You got raspberry blueberry, strawberry grape, strawberry blue. It's a lot of different stuff. I'm very, very, very much a fan of it. Raspberry blueberry. Ooh, get that blueberry aftermath. Those are good. Those are actually really good. Um, ah, shoot. I'm gonna put them above original once again. And the fruit punch, man. Those are tough. Those are those are a competitive game. Yeah. I'm gonna put those above fruit punch. And like the fruit punch, the difference is there's only two different flavors in the fruit punch, whereas in the very berry, there's three. And not only are the very berry flavors, there's more of them, but they're actually better flavors, in my opinion. So for that reason, they're going above. Okay, next up, we go to octopi, cherry grape, strawberry, blue raspberry, orange lemon. Now this package, the strawberry is green. So that's an interesting twist on it. Now these are all kind of sort of stuck together. These always look so fun. Look at that. That's always so fun. Look at that. I'm excited for this. This is the strawberry, strawberry, blue raspberry. I guess I just, mmm, mmm, ooh, that's a good flavor. I think the strawberry, the strawberry blue raspberry of the octopi. I'm gonna keep saying octopi, regardless if it's correct or not. But that's one of my top flavors, just overall, like of all the different ones. Um, we've got cherry grape. It's okay. It's, it's, it's traditional. It tastes like a baseline kind of thing. And we got orange lemon for the final flavor. Uh, that's all right. Um, really, the only flavor that was like amazing for me was the strawberry blue raspberry. There are three different flavors, and I like the shape. I like the little little octopus shape there. I think it's pretty awesome. Very creative. I think I like the flavors better than the fruit punch ones, just by a little bit, just because the fruit punch ones are a little bit they're okay now, they're, honestly the fruit punch was really high at the beginning as you guys know it was really high at the beginning and then it has slowly worked its way down i would say the octopus are probably just one take above the fruit punch it's crazy to me that going in i thought i was like oh yeah i thought the traditional were going to be one of those traditional where like you know the original sour bright crawlers was like top of the list but no it took me by surprise it's actually just in the top five next up the last two flavors we have the sour bright blasts and the gummy creations I'm gonna go the gummy creations last because I, I feel like I want to play with it. We have the sour bright blasts, so these are gonna have goo in them. So hopefully they're not like uberly gooberly sour. Do they do they have flavors? Strawberry mango is this one. Ooh, that's gonna be good. Then we have apple watermelon. Cherry lime and blue raspberry lemon. I'm excited. I'm excited to try these. Okay, we have strawberry mango going first. I can't tell. I think the juice is mango and the outside is strawberry, but you can't really taste the outside. That one's okay. Next up is the blue, which I'm going to assume is blue raspberry lemon. That one's okay. The flavors in these are a little bit weird. This one is cherry lime. There's a lime. Holy crap. Cherry lime, I don't think it's it. And finally, finally we've got apple watermelon. I hope this is good. This looks good. Look, it would be good. Apple watermelon's better than all the other ones. This is not very high, honestly. I was expecting it to be higher, but it, it, it just didn't meet the mark. I'd probably say just a tick above the watermelon shark, so this is gonna go in the sixth spot. So the original crawlers can maintain in the top five as of right now. The final, <clears throat> oh man. The final gummy we have is the Sour Gummy Creation Martian Mix. So you can make little alien guys out of it. Over 200 flavor combinations, apparently. Which I guess makes sense. You've got strawberry, pineapple, lemonade, watermelon, mango, blue raspberry. That's six different flavors. So you got, there's hundreds upon hundreds of combinations. First, Wow, okay. We've got, I'm just gonna try them piece by piece. We've got the red little loop-de-loop -loop looking thing. This is strawberry. These are all just like basic by themselves. Like they're not together. Like most of these flavors have like boom, boom instead of just boom as far as flavor goes. A lot of these are on loops. Like they have the little, little hole pieces kind of thing. Blue raspberry, good. Ooh, that was a watermelon. Ooh. Mm, I'm a fan. Um, then we've got the green, which is something. It's a little, like, hole opening looking little guy. Pineapple's the flavor. Here's a little alien head. There it is. There's a little alien head. I don't know how these are actually supposed to, like, stick together. It's just, I mean, I guess it can. This is lemonade. Lemonade? Instead of lemon, it's just lemonade. Okay. I will say, I like the idea. It's creative. I feel like as far, I feel like as, far as functionality, not great. But I'm not judging it on that because, obviously, it's candy. It's not going to be the most structurally sound thing in the world. But the flavors are nice. And, you know, lemonade, pineapple, watermelon mango like that's a good that's a good flavor palette so i'm gonna say this one is probably gonna go just i think i like it just a hair better than the 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 gooey cube thing what is this the blasts i feel like it's just a little bit more of a creative idea and plus the flavors are a little bit better the the blasts were good it was just the flavors were intermixed with the weirdness you know what i'm saying it was weird that completes the list so going on to the top 10 before we get into the top 10 list you guys are new to the channel consider subscribing so number 10 we've got the big bold bears these just this was a the least sour of the bunch just because they had literally no sour stuff on them. That's not a point, but even still, the texture was weird. It was hard to chew into them. The flavor wasn't very pronounced, so it wasn't like super duper good gummy bear. Next to last, ninth place, we have the mystery night crawlers with the mystery flavor. It was a little weird. I don't know. These were just, they just didn't taste, they just didn't taste
taste super good. Next up, we have the sour watermelon sharks. The sharks, the flavor was good. The watermelon taste was actually pretty good. It was just the texture and the fact that they just didn't really stack up to their competitors. Next, we've got the sour bright blast coming in seventh place. These were okay. One thing I had a problem with was that the flavors didn't quite go together. I felt like cherry lime really threw me off. I mean, obviously cherry lime made the thing, but it was okay. They were just okay. Coming in at six, we have the sour gummy creations. These were a very cute, very creative idea. I like it. I'm a fan, and the flavors are good. I think what's good about these is the flavors by themselves. So you can really tell, you know, strawberries are strawberry, blue raspberry is blue raspberry, and so on and so forth. You can really tell. So that one takes the sixth spot. Coming in at fifth we have the regular Sour Bright Gummy Worm Crawler things. These are good. The flavors, I, I didn't have them higher just because these are original, you know? Very rarely are you gonna have an original thing be the best, unless it's like original Doritos. Doritos, nacho cheese, whatever. That, I can see some being up there pretty often. But these, they were okay. The flavors are normal. They are just, they're better than the ones behind it. Coming in at fourth place, we have the Fruit Punch Crawlers. These were really, really good for me at the beginning, and I was actually really, really high on them, but as, it, as more and more came along, they sort of fell back, but they didn't quite quite go past fourth just because the flavors are different than the originals but just there's only two different flavors you know there's yeah it's just two fruit punch flavors it's, it's red orange and blue yellow so like you know you get two flavors and that's all so they would have been higher had there been a more a better variety and i feel like if there would have been a better variety the other flavors would have chimed in been really good as far as the overall score coming in at number three we have the sour bright octopus the octopi these were really good i really liked the strawberry blue raspberry the other two were okay they were pretty pretty mute they weren't like mute but they were just like basic flavors you know but i like these better than say fruit punch or the original just because like first of all i love the shape the octopus shape is really interesting and it provides some sort of like intrigue as you're eating them instead of just like oh it's a worm it's like an octopus and you can feel it in your mouth that's cool and just like the, the different combinations of flavors were good if i had to rank the three flavors on here strawberry blue raspberry first cherry grape and then orange lemon. coming in a second place we have the highest ranked worm of the entire competition they're very brave these were good i like the the different combinations you've got they're all they're all berry uh, raspberry blueberry strawberry blackberry blue raspberry berry punch these were all good every one of these flavors hit and they all hit the mark they were all very delicious i was a fan i was just a fan coming in at first the only option left on the board process of elimination deems these sour bright llamas to be better i don't know exactly what the theme is here but we've got passion fruit pineapple mango berry punch and strawberry blue Blueberry. And I believe, oh, this is strawberry blackberry, but the strawberry blueberry was very good. The, just all these flavors were really good as well. And I like the creativity of the llamas, even though the llamas were a little deformed, but it's okay. These are definitely the favorite for sure. One and two could have been interchangeable, but I still feel like for me, the sour bright llamas took the cake anyway. So if you guys had any differing opinions on these, let me know down in the comments below. If you agree, disagree, indifferent, whatever, let me know. And if you're brand new to the channel, consider subscribing. It's free and it helps out a ton, and you can always unsubscribe later if you feel the need to do so. But if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment down below. This has been Gary the Bear. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you guys again next time.